Hi guys, this is App Unwrapper. I'm back with Cube Escape Paradox, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to get through Chapter 2. I'm not going to show you any achievements in this video, though. I'm going to save them for another. Enjoy! Alright, up here, see this windmill? Um, the X at the bottom has a little white light pointing to the lower right. And there's one square lit up above that. So, that's telling you to turn the blade with one square on it over here. Now, it's four going this way. Now three, pointing this way. Two, pointing this way. Three, pointing this way again. And there you go. Grab the paper piece. All right, go right. And there's nothing in here this time. So we're gonna unlock this box. And it goes, this is tougher than last time, so. Oops. So, it's trickier. Uh, hold on. So the eye has to go up there. Let's get things out of the way. So now Nope, wrong one. Almost there. All right. Another paper piece. Okay, next, go right and grab the burning cigar. Also notice that, oh, notice this says not the red vial this time. Okay, turn right, another paper, there's a fish. Can't do anything with it yet. Screwdriver. That's it for now. Um, okay, notice. If you touch this and 
oil oozes out. We're going to need that later. Add these. All right, next. The light switch. So it's broken, but if you unscrew all these, now you can fix it. All right, so go right, get the paper, and then let's add it. Okay, so 945. Let's go change the channel to 945. Cat thinks she's getting another dinner, so if you hear her, that's what that is. Go deeper into your mind. Look at the painting. And burn your soul. Ooh. Okay, so we're gonna do what he said. Look at the painting and burn your soul using the burning cigar. A key. All right. Let's go use the key. Take the knife. You can open this. Grab the bedroom and Arles label painting, painting label. And okay, we have to stack these books. Um, oh, take the eyeball first and then stack these books. So, goes like this. Oops. Okay, so we have to get... Now we can move that. It's, I forgot the name of this. But um There we go. I might have made it more complicated than it needed to be, but we're almost there. Okay, ultimate guide to mental health. Let's look through it. The past is never dead. It's clues for a bunch of different puzzles. Okay, it's showing you to give the knife to the hand. Take this. And that's it for now. Let's move on. Place the photo in here. And let's go to the painting. I always go the wrong way. All right, add this bedroom in Arles. If you played uh, Cube Escape Arles, you should remember this. And just move everything the right spots. And take the ear. Alright, so this is weird. Look in the mirror and cut your head open with a knife. Yeah, we're doing that. Take your brain out. All right, you've got your brain. Now, give the knife to this hand. And now we've got a heart. And a knife. Okay. 
Uh, let's go back to the jars. Because we've got four body parts. And you need to put them in the jars so that they all have the same level, the same water level. Now you can read this. It says to call A. Vanderboom for more information. So, go back to this fish drawer. Use a knife to cut open the fish and now move the bones around. triangle key to open up everything. So here's a telephone directory and here oops is a magnifying glass. Nothing there. So we needed a Vanderboom, remember? So you can use this to find Vanderboom A. 36772. So, 36772. Go back to the phone and call. <laughs> Detective Vandermeer. Hello? My name is Aldous Vanderboom. What can you tell me? Are you looking for a new present mind? I think so. I am confident the new mind is not far away. Where should I look? You have been looking before. What do you mean? Watch yourself. Channel 412. Okay. Alright, channel 412. So there's a magnifying glass on there. Notice that? Play it again for you. It goes a little quickly. See, magnifying glass pretty quickly. So, why do I always tap on the wrong spot? Wait, where is it? Ah, there we go. TV 492. showed you a magnifying glass on here. TV 879. So now it showed you, you saw that? A little magnifying glass in that box. Come over here. TV 278. All right, let's go back to the TV. 278. Okay, so now the fish. Oops. Aha! Alright, you remember the globe puzzle. So 
so we've got another one of these. I found this one a little easier, I think. So, start. You're going through the mountains. Now through the trees. Through the icebergs, islands, whatever you want to call them. through this path. Now, going between the theater and the mountains. Then you're going past the mountains. Sorry, my cat is causing trouble. Uh, next, you're going towards an island, I guess. Not an island, you're going towards the mountains, you're going past the island. Okay, now past the police station and this little town. And now towards the trees. Now between the trees, now the windmill, past the chapel, now between the mountains, now it's this thing on the right, and the end, there we go. It's a brain. All right, this one is a little tricky. So we're gonna have to do a TD a tower defense game. Um, hopefully I won't mess it up. Bear with me if I do. All right. Okay, why didn't I get him? Ah, all right. It's not getting them. Not getting them. Oh no. Okay, it worked when I did it last time. You have three lives, but for some reason it's not working. Oh, I did it. Okay. I still did it. Alright. So now we have a present mind. So let's go to the mirror and put it in. Welcome to your present mind. Thank you for having me as your counsel. Let's examine your current state. But first, I would like a cup of coffee. All right, open this. Take that and that. You can look through this, there's nothing there yet. Um, so he wants a cup of coffee, but first let's go play the cassette.
Mr. Vandermeer. I will show you five images. Tell me what you see. One, I see a moth. Two, a crow. Three, murder. Four, fear. Five, I see my corrupted soul. Thank you, Mr. Vandermeer. I remember all that. I forgot, though. We need the cup from him. Welcome to your present mind. Thank you for having me as your counsel. Let's examine your current state. But first, I would like a cup of coffee. Oh, there. That was weird. Um, I had to tap on his right arm to get the coffee. I would like a cup of coffee. That, I don't know why specifically that, but there you go. Um, all right. Come here, plant the seed. Get some water. It's oil. Do a cup with oil. And this is what this tells you actually what you need. The reason I know what we need is this. Buy the amazing rusty coffee maker. Ground coffee, water, and fuel. So now, got a bunch of images, right? So do you remember the tape? Let's go back and listen to the tape again. Thank you, Mr. Vandermeer. Oh. So moth. Two, a crow. Crow. Three, murder. Murder. Four, fear. Five, I see my corrupted soul. Thank you, Mr. Vandermeer. All right. So. Oh my God. Uh. So one was moth. So find the moth. That's moth, so that's a symbol for moth. Next is crow. So that's a symbol for crow. The next was murder. Oops, that's murder. So that's a symbol for murder. The next is fear. So that's the symbol for fear. And then corrupted soul. That's the symbol for corrupted soul. So now we're gonna enter those five symbols. That. Oh. That. So this is S. This is I. Okay, take a 
light bulb. Alright, so here, this weird contraption, let's screw in the light bulb. So now there's a heart, and you need to drag it to love. Then turn this again. The next one is confusion. Another confusion. This one's fear. Love. file. Yay! Alright, next. Take the break. This coffee is too bitter. Alright. We're gonna have to get him some sugar. Let's go to the mirror and change into our present mind. Oops. Now we're wearing our present mind. Okay. Or wait, is it the past mind? That's the mind of the past. Never mind. We're wearing our mind of the past. So. Talk to your parents. Hello, son. Happy birthday. Please, prepare the decorations. All right, so decorations. These go like this. are pretty easy. Just go zero, one, two, three, four, five, six. The last one is a little trickier. You go by segments. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right. Next. Back. Time to party. Please call Mr. Alander, the magician. All right, so we need Mr. Alander. So E. Islander D. Five seven six seven one. Magic show. Oh, Aylander, not Islander. When will you arrive? I'm already here. Where? In front of the door. Creepy. <laughs> ah. Okay, so where'd he go? Talk to her. Is he hiding somewhere? Look at yourself, son. He's somewhere in the world. So they give she gives you hints. Ah. And now it's pretty obvious where he is. I love that though. Creepy. 
All right, so he's holding up four fingers. So count the antlers. There's four prongs on the right one, so tap the right one. Now he's holding up five. So let's tap the right again. Four. Three. Five. Three. Three. Four. Four. There you go. He's gone again. Turn on channel 369. Look behind you. Yeah. Ah. Alright, so tap on anywhere. So now he's pointing to his right pocket. Now he's pointing to his left pocket. Now he's pointing to his right pocket again. Now he's pointing at his head. Left pocket. Head. Left pocket. Head. Right pocket. Left pocket. And it's gone again. Time to open your present. Yay! Presents! <laughs> ah! Oh no. Ah! That's not cool, man. All right, grab the newspaper article. And this is pretty simple. Um, you just wanna take a look around. So first, so notice that symbol up there. In the box, you have four things. You have the TV, the vial ca cabinet, the painting, and the clock. So you need to pay attention to the symbols on each. So this one is the painting. This one is the clock. This one is the TV. We learned so while we're here. Okay, so this is the TV vial cabinet. And now we're just gonna change just gonna move those around. So this goes up here. Just like that. Now you have the mind of the future. Okay, let's go put on the mind of the future. Everything's yellow. All right. Okay, two chairs. Please seal and return this letter after reading. Okay. So, notice the little flame on there. So you're gonna burn it in it up and if you go back over here the hand tells you to deliver it to the hand so first you need to remove your brain and now you can deliver the letter to the hand Now, oops, wrong, here. Okay, now we have film, tape. Uh, let's go to the projector. And now you just need to order these. It's not too difficult. Uh, you can move this, para. Docks. Come on, being a little difficult. Where is it? 
So you got it so far? We're playing the movie from, assuming you watched the movie. There we go. You can look at it again if you, uh, or not. Okay. So now, turn it on. There we go. And... Oops. Alright, so, you need to match one of these drawings to the scene. So, this one is the moth's wing. This one is his tie. This one is Mr. Crow. Uh, oh wait, it's not Mr. Crow, it's that guy. This is the dresser. Now we have Mr. Crow. His face. Mountains, her lips, and now her face. <gasps> we have a funeral card, and now some clues here. All right, so you see four. We have the door with an X on it, the globe with a dot on it, the deer head with an X on it, and the vial cabinet with a dot on it. Uh, so here's what we're going to do. This is a tough one. Um, first let's go. Oh, also tap on this. There you go. I forgot about that. So now we have the corrupted statue. Let's go place the funeral card in here. We also, oops, no, that's the wrong one. It goes here. Oh wait, it is the right one. This goes here. Alright, so the funeral card says TV 207. Right? Let's go to 207. Ah, creepy. Zoom out, tap on it. Okay, so it's pointing left. Turn left, tap on her, she points left. This now, tap on it, points left. Tap on it, points right. Tap on it, right, 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 left, left. Left, left, right, right, there we go, take the woman statue. Alright, next, uh, so this, this part is tricky, um, take a look at the book. So this clock says the past is never dead, and there's a little image of the deer skull at the top by 12 on the clock and the window is at six so this is telling you and there's four walls around the clock it's it's not so easy to tell that that's the tricky part you're supposed to notice that there's four walls around it uh so this is a room the room is a clock so the deer head is 12 so that means let's say you go to the deer head we're standing here we need to find the other thing so if we turn right we have the vial cabinet and that would make it three o'clock so then we turn right again, and there we see the window at 6 o'clock. Turn again, we get the door at 9 o'clock. Turn again, we're back at 12, and the globe would then be 11. Um, I hope that makes sense. So, again, you have the deer skull is 12, the vial cabinet is 3, the window is 6, the door is 9, the globe is 11. And now, we go back. So, the left pane... The left panel says is the door at X, meaning X, the X hand goes to 9, 
and the globe, the dot hand goes to 11. So the first is going to be um, 11.45. Okay, that's going to be the time. So let's go do that first. I always go the wrong way. So 11.45. So the X, remember, was 9. And the dot was 11. Okay. Then we have this thing. And the right panel. Oh my god. So the deer was 12, that's X. And the vial cabinet was 3. Right? So X is deer is 12, dot is 3. So 12, 3. So it's 3 o'clock. All right. Change your mind to the past. And use this key, this coin as a key. And now we have the man statue. Okay, change to your present mind. Give him his sugar. This coffee is too bitter. There you go. Now you have a crow statue. Alright. Change to your future mind. Welcome to the future. One of us will die, the other will be enlightened. Please, make the right move, Dale. Okay, place these all on here. Alright, so if you move one, notice it says that it's touching and you're not allowed to touch. So, you need to move them. So, no, not touching, what am I saying? They can't be in the same row or column or diagonal. So, it goes like this. five symbols remember them and which uh, which characters which which statues they're next to because then we're gonna go over here so this shows us number one is the corrupted soul number two is mr. or dr. crow number three is Dale nine-year-old boy Four is Laura, and five is Mr. Owl. So remember that. Again, I have this all on my site, but if you don't, now you can go back and look. So you have the symbols, and enter them in the right order. It might be easier to go to my website to do all this. I'm not sure that video is best for everything. Can get anyways for you. All right, take Harvey's song. I always go the long way around. I've never, I never learn. All right. So let's see. What is that that song makes him leave so we have to rewind it to rewind it
Johnson. We are back at where it all began. Harvey's egg. Alright, so he said <laughs> Johnson. I don't know why that always gives me the wrong spot. Alright. So find Johnson bird feed. Bird food. Oh, it's the wrong page. J. Johnson. So Johnson J D E. Five four two five three. So we're gonna go five four two five three. Hello, Johnson Bird Food. Do you sell parrot food? Yes, we do. Do you deliver? Yes, we deliver. One packet of parrot food to Rusty Lake. We will deliver in the future. Thank you. So make you're already in the future, so it's there. Otherwise, change to your future brain. Bird food. Give it to Harvey. Now you have an egg. All right. So you remember. told to give the egg to the hand so we have to get the hand present again wait let me see does she have anything else to say we are back at where it all began Harvey's egg I cannot think. I cannot think. Alright, so, cut open his head. Give him present mind first. Dale, we meet again. Finding your corrupted soul is the final test. Okay. Now give him the mind of the past. Wait, what? Don't wait. Once I was a man you. A great sacrifice was needed to become something else. Oh, he's a fish. My time is limited, Dale. I need a successor, the ruler of the lake. Dale. Continue your journey and face your corrupted soul. Yeah. All right. We have all three. Blue vial. Remember, we're not supposed to drink it, but we're drinking it anyways. I mean, that was in the first chapter. We're allowed to drink it this time, but... Yeah. Alright, go around the room. Tap them off. All right, you ready to head out back into the forest? All right, follow the arrows on the trees.
Ah, it's you. All right, we have a map now. So, first off, we're going to head to the X, all right? So, let's do that. know what to do. Okay, so now we have a knife. Now, if you walk, notice... Notice this man running around, so follow him. Okay, wrong way. Going this way. It's going this way. It's going this way. This way. Ah, here we are. Please embrace your corrupted soul. All right. So another rock. So follow the rock. To. here. Okay. Another statue. And these dots on the tree is act are actually a path. If you start at the bottom left, the one that's circled, and make your way up to the arrow. Okay? So it's right once, then up one, two, three, then right twice. So right, one, two, three, Oh no. Another corrupted statue. Alright. Now, leave. You see the deer man running? Follow him. Okay, wrong way. He's going this way. Alright, we were going the right way. This way. Okay. This way. Uh. All right. He's going all the way back. There he goes, okay. There he goes. Ah! Ah! Keep running. Ah. I know you have made your choice. Use your corrupted soul. All right, now we're going to keep going. We're over here. So we're going to go up. So there's something here. If you go left. Look, it's Movie Dale. You get an achievement if you're on Steam, not on iOS. We are all trapped. We are all trapped. We are, aren't we? Okay, keep going. There's nothing here. Ah! 
<laughs> yep, that's what we gotta do. Yeah, watch the movie for more achieve for the hidden achievements. I am going to show you how to get all those in the other videos. If you enjoyed this, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks. Bye-bye.